poison those Benadryl. All these hoes want the same thing like a synonym, damn. And it's chain, rings, queen, Celine. So today's topic is gonna be a celebrity talk, and y'all already know who I'm talking about. I'm talking about Nick and Meek Mill. Y'all, I don't know what the hell going on. I really thought they really forgot about each other, and I really thought they was living their own little life, but apparently they beefing with each other. They beefing with each other, and I'm just like, wait. When is y'all rekindled or something? I don't But that's what we're gonna be talking about today. Now, is y'all ready? Is y'all ready? All right, let's go. All right, so let's, let me start off by saying like, I felt like when they first were together, they were really cute. I felt like that was so cute. Nikki was actually happy. Nikki won't. The Nikki that she is today, and I'm going, I'm going to get into that. But back then, they was so happy, and I really want them to last. I really want them to keep going with their relationship because honestly, I have not seen Nikki with nobody else except for Safari. Really, actually getting into a real relationship between that whole situation, I only seen her with Safari. I thought her getting with Meek was going to break that. It actually kind of break that because y'all see how Safari lives. And Safari ain't worried about what Nikki got going on. As I know of. It don't look like he is. Maybe he is, I don't know. But it don't look like he is. Like he having his living his own little life. He got a baby. He got married. He got his own problems to worry about. Nikki, on the other hand, I don't know what the fuck going on with her. I just don't know what the hell 2020 the main Nikki. I don't know. But I did used to like their relationship. I felt like their relationship was gonna last, but you know shit happened, and you just be like, well move on with your life but apparently they didn't move on i'm not gonna say they didn't move on together they apparently moved on separately but they got some you know business that they got together that still ain't been solved so i'm just like where did all this come from in my opinion we're gonna talk about meek in my opinion meek is cute. I, say he cute I really feel like meek is ugly but he got his own little swag you know what i'm saying meek is really i feel like he got his own little swag going on to make him you know who he is but personally if i was nicky i wouldn't have dated him but he might be a cool chill person maybe i don't know i'll take that back i say i wouldn't have dated him i just by looking at him no but his personality is probably far he got his own little swag he got his own little thing going on so i can see why she kind of fell in love with that but honestly i don't know i just feel like me kind of you know ski but he got his own little swag going on so i'm like all right all right me you got nikki you got the bad at the back <laughs> baby i didn't know how the hell a meek meal got with um nikki i was just like okay he feeling himself but that shows y'all no matter how cute how bad y'all is niggas gonna still find a way to cheat on you niggas gonna still do what the heck they want to do no matter if you with them or not so it's just like at the end of the day do what's best for you and do what you want to do with your life because sure you never know. You never know. We will get back to Nikki. Nikki actually blocked me on Instagram. She blocked my ass on Instagram. But I still kind of mess with her a little bit. You know what I mean? I used to rock with Nikki harder back then. Like, back in the day, Nikki was that big. Like, nobody could really tell her nothing. But now, um, I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. I'm not going to say I don't like Nikki. Because I actually feel like she is, you know, she has some good in her. She has some good in her that everybody's seen. Now, I feel like Nikki trying to bring out what her real person like her real personality is and i'm not mad at her from that i feel like like everybody has their own opinion and is entitled to have their own opinion but to a certain extent like when you famous i feel like you can't say certain shit you can't do certain shit and that's not our fault it's not their fault let me say that back. it's not their fault i feel like it's our fault because we put pressure on them and then make them feel like Oh, I gotta say this, cause they, cause my fans are made me say, like that's another thing. We gotta stop making them say, <laughs> say stuff that they don't wanna say because fans be getting out of hand, and y'all know they do got feelings too. You know they gonna clap back. Maybe some most of the time, famous people don't really clap back, but if you keep pushing their buttons, they gonna clap back sooner or later. So I feel like we gotta stop being so negative in the world and just really start spreading out joy and like just because they famous and we feel like they don't see what we say. Most of the time, they do see what they do see what y'all say. So it's just like we all gotta just come to our senses and be like, all right, we know what not to say. We know they got feelings too. Everybody live their own life. Everybody got their own thing going on. I just feel like at the end of the day, just let people be. All right, we gonna get back to Nikki. I feel like Nikki is really shady. <laughs> She's sneaky. What else? She's cute. Shady, sneaky, cute, all in one. <laughs> all in one. Y'all think Snoopy wanna say hey to y'all? Cause he came over here. Hey, Snoopy. Hey, 
She a big ass baby. But um, what was I saying? Yeah, she's shady. She cute. She's secretive. I don't know. When they, I, I thought I figured her all the way out, but you know. You, you can't really figure nobody all the way out if you don't personally know them, but she's letting all her shit out now. I, I don't know why all of a sudden she felt like this was the right time, but hey, this is her right time. It's her story. It's her life that she's living, and she is in the public eye, so she got to watch what she say. Same as me. He got to watch me. Same as everybody. Everybody got to watch what they say, and I feel like they shouldn't have to watch what they say because at the end of the day, they're their own person. They can say whatever they want to say, but when you have that certain extent, when you have that certain personality when you're famous you can't say exactly what you want to say they can do whatever they want to do and they are i, I don't know how to really handle this situation i feel like i wouldn't put this on social media i feel like any problems that i would have they wouldn't be on social media they i would just like keep that to myself or maybe i don't know i don't know why they felt like they had to put that personal you know because that whole situation is getting a little bit personal and I just, I don't know. And then I heard that, I guess Nikki and her boyfriend was in the store and Meek popped up and then they started exchanging words. I don't know if they got to fight. I don't know. But then I feel like, I don't know why they even fighting. If I feel like Nikki's with her dude, then let them be with her dude. I don't know if he was fighting because he still wanted to be with, I don't, I don't think he wanted to be with Nikki because he got a whole child on the way. But it's little pieces that be missing. And for us to like try to put our own puzzle pieces in there, it just be a whole, you know, other situation that we don't even know about. We going off of what this person said, what that person say, and it's, it's gonna be a whole nother situation that we don't even wanna get into. I just feel like they both just need to grow up a little bit and leave all that out of social media, out of social media, and live their life. And just live their life, live their life, because shoot, we only getting older around. Right? So that was it in my video. I hope y'all liked it. I want y'all to like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. You know I love you. Bye, ho! She want it, it's a dream, keep on going, she twerk.